in the Africans in the central part of Africa was dealing with the concept of a deity, God and a goddess. No one in the world, any place in the world, even knew or had any idea of a God by the name of Jehovah, Jesus, and or Allah. It was thousands of years later that what the Africans had brought forth to mankind as a whole, those that were living, and I need to make this very clear, not a single Hebrew or Jew existed. Christian, Muslim, uh, Hindu, Buddhist, or anything existed when the Africans on the line, along the Nile were already dealing with the concept of a deity. The most common at the earliest time was the deity symbolized, symbolized by the sun. Not the sun. Never once did the Africans preach that any material things or any other animal was the deity but use these as symbols of the deity. Many of you would be going to Egypt quite soon and other places on the continent and you would c go and come back with the same mythology that missionaries has placed in your mind. You would talk of the sun god and that the ancient Egyptians and others of Africa worship animals, birds, etc. And that isn't true. It's a saying, it is of saying that Christians worship the cross. And you know that is not true. It's, sim it's a symbol. When you see, and that the media.